The conflict between Ron DeSantis and Disney is continuing to escalate and it is going to get very brutal over the next few days as Ron DeSantis is putting the hammer down on Disney in the wake of the whole don't say gay bill situation that has been going on down there. And indeed, there's a lot of conflict around that already between Ron DeSantis and Disney as they continue to show that they are both on very opposite sides of the viewpoint on this whole situation with Ron DeSantis wanting to protect children from the indoctrination that is taking place in the government school system. Meanwhile, Disney wants more of it. They love it and they want to continue to push that on children. It is very interesting to see Disney continue to expose themselves as not being a company that actually cares about the well-being of children, but is going to continue to push for the destabilization, the destruction of the nuclear family. So, Disney is a guest in Florida. DeSantis moves to end Disney's self-governance. Republican Florida Governor Ron DeSantis announced Tuesday that Florida lawmakers are considering the termination of Disney's Reedy Creek Improvement District. This is this is this is groundbreaking news. This is absolutely crazy that that we are at this point. But honestly, I have a lot of respect for Ron DeSantis for doing this. Um, Governor DeSantis' position is that all businesses in Florida should be able to compete on a fair playing field without company-specific carve-outs or special favor from government, Press Secretary Christina Pusha told The Daily Wire on Tuesday. And of course, that is indeed correct. The move reminds Disney that the company is a guest in Florida, according to Florida State Representative uh, Randy Fine. Fine said Tuesday that DeSantis' ex expansion of the special session allows him to file HB 3C, eliminating a 50-year-old special statute that makes Disney too, too exempt from laws faced by regular Floridians, which is pretty crazy, allowing Disney to enjoy its own zoning privileges. That is actually pretty insane. I didn't even know about this until just today when I was reading about it. I didn't know that, 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 that Disney had this sort of power in in the state of florida so it's very interesting that uh the, some of the stuff that i've been reading about this but the florida legislator is meeting this week to consider the congressional reapportionment plan for florida for the next 10 years and that is what they have been called upon to do de santa said tuesday at a pref press conference but i am announcing today that we are expanding the call of what they are going to be considering this week and of course, like I said, this is all an escalation over the Don't Say Gay bill. DeSantis targets at Disney's self-governing status in escalation over Don't Say Gay. Like I said, it shouldn't even be called that in the first place because it, like, that's just a narrative that's being tw twisted completely by the mainstream media and by places like Disney. It doesn't have anything to do with that in the first place, but... That's that's the mainstream media for you, right? Legislators are already scheduled to hold a three-and-a-half-day special session where they will pass a new congressional map proposed by the governor that will help the GOP pick up seats in the upcoming election. And, of course, this is coming from Politico, so of course they would say that. But, <laughs> um, honestly, uh, it, it's just really awesome to see that Ron DeSantis is continuing to do the stuff that he's doing down there. Um, you know, he, he has earned a lot of respect from me over the past, you know, couple years since he's been working and stuff and it's been very cool to see as he can he continues to stand up for floridians and that is floridians of all ages including the children so ron DeSantis says that this week florida lawmakers will officially cons consider the termination of disney's reedy creek improvement district so let's go ahead and check out what this video is all about here what they've been called upon to do but I am announcing today that we are expanding the call of what they are going to be considering this week. And so, yes, they will be considering the congressional map, but they also will be considering termination of all special districts that were enacted in Florida prior to 1968. And that includes the Reedy Creek Improvement District. Boom. Boom. So this is absolutely crazy. This could be a huge game changer just for the whole landscape of what entertainment is, especially when it comes to Disney and everything else. And just some of the power that Disney has in the state of Florida. And it's going to be very interesting to see how this continues to shake out. So let me know what you think about this in the comments below. What do you think about what is going on in Florida? All of the craziness uh, surrounding Disney and Ron DeSantis and, and the Don't Say Gay Bill and everything else. Love to hear what you have to say 
so let me know um leave a like subscribe and i'll talk to you all in another video very soon bye